Thanksgiving dinner is going to cost you more this year because of inflation. Rising food costs coupled with supply chain issues are really putting the squeeze on a lot of local food pantries. CBS 2's Lauren Victory is live from the West Suburban Community Pantry in Woodridge with some staggering numbers. Lauren. Hi there, Marie and Jim. Will organizers tell me a Thanksgiving dinner cost as little as $12 last year thanks to buying in bulk and being able to subsidize in other ways. This year, green bean casserole and the rest of the meal will cost at least $20. Welcome to the pantry. The sky used to be the limit at West Suburban Community Pantry. That was when 250 households came through a month. Now they're serving almost 750 families. <laughs> Zandra Cook is a regular. This really helped supplement our income. I really, it's been a lifesaver. Lately, she noticed her disability check doesn't go as far at the grocery store. Eggs? Yeah. $3.35 for eggs. For those that don't know it outside of Chicago, that is ridiculous. There you go. Thank you. Inflation isn't just affecting clients' wallets, it's affecting the pantries. Donated dollars can't buy as much, and extra supplies that used to be dropped off from area stores aren't coming. Fish? No surplus, thanks to supply chain issues. Rich Lozick is experiencing the same problems as head of procurement at the Glen Ellen Food Pantry. In the month of January, we were purchasing $2,300 per month from the food bank. Last month it was over $6,500. The pain in their pockets is worsened by a shortage of subsidized products, thanks to higher demand and supply chain struggles. In some cases, they're forced to pay retail rates. In August, we spent $775 at the grocery store in order to accommodate all the needs of our neighbors. In October, it was up to $2,200. The fear is prices and need will rise as the okay. holidays approach. I can't imagine what a ham and a turkey is going to cost this year. Cook hopes compassion from the public increases as well. I don't expect them to give, but I sure do appreciate it when they do. Organizers in Glen Ellen and here are going to be hosting several food drives to help them fill those gaps this holiday season. In fact, today is the first day of Harvest Week here at the West Suburban Community Pantry. That means you should notice several bins for toy and food donations at various locations in this area. Reporting live in Woodridge, I'm Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Lauren.